that looks like I shot this on a freaking iPod touch. What the hell? Y'all, they took the whole entire Smith machine out. Keep the organization, you guys. It is color coordinated up in here. Get into it. New year, new vibes. Same me, just better energy. Gonna try a cute new hairstyle for the gym today because what is this? I did a middle part and then I did a, I did a diagonal part. I'm gonna go in with some Eco Styler. I'm just gonna leave it curly. So I'm just gonna wet it a little bit. That way it'll kind of just stay locked in place. Do a little finger coil. Ah, oh, so cute! Who knew my hair was this long? Anyway, I kind of did like a little, I added hair in, so I don't know. We'll see if this is giving when I get to the other side. I just added some hair. And just braid it regular. trying to be productive and honestly I was getting ready I am barely cute on this channel you guys so I was like let me film a reels did my hair gym makeup is cute I'll link my favorite products down below so what do you guys think I think the braids are cute it's definitely giving me summer vibes though time to pick out our gym fit which honestly this is the crucial part. We need to feel good in our outfit and not be in the gym worrying about how we look, adjusting the waistband, does our butt look good? We already know my beef when it comes to leggings and I'm about to do legs today. So I don't know if I wanna actually wear leggings or pick a pair of bikers, but I also feel like my life is together since I did my makeup for once, y'all. I be looking like a beat up big toe on this channel and I really need to start putting effort into how I look because I know that I always just feel like better sorry that looks a little cuter so I'm like do I want to wear a matching matching set because I know whenever I have a full matching set on all the same brand baby you can't tell me nothing I'm walking into that gym head held high I'm doing what I need to do I'm lifting heavier because of it so <laughs> I think we're gonna maybe lean towards I don't know I'm I'm kind of in the vibe of like OG Alphalete Amplify because I have a lot of matching long sleeves since it's like 50 out so I definitely want a color I know I have a color top in rainfall which is like a blue a blue type of shade oh I wish I could show you my activewear tops because it is so organized 
peep the organization you guys it is color coordinated up in here Ooh, or i should do french blue oh i don't know or should i do french blue do i have a matching long sleeve in french blue i actually don't i don't no, I've been wearing a lot of blue. Actually, I've been wearing a lot of browns lately. Oh, wait, we do have French blue long sleeve. You guys. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? Rainfall was like literally one of the first launches. I haven't worn this. It's a small. Girl, I hope it still fits. <laughs> I've been getting some back gains out here. Stop playing with me. And my leggings. Ugh. Got them. I love having my leggings out on this shelf. I'll link the shelf below. It's like 20 bucks. I don't know, but it's so good even if you want to put it in your closet so you can actually see all the leggings that you have. So, like I said, this is the OG um, Elfly Amplify color in Rainfall. I just felt like the waistband and the cut, the material was the most flattering of all the collections. So, I think this would be a fun leg day outfit. What do you guys think? I'm going to have to try it on and see if I feel good in it. If not, maybe we're putting on shorts. We're putting on shorts. I need a bra though too. Maybe like a white sports bra. This actually kind of matches. It's like a bluish tonal type of shade. So I think if we're going to wear those leggings, which I'll try on first, then we'll wear that top. I just hope these look cute. I have not put these on in forever, but I'm trying to wear active wear in my collection that I haven't worn in a long time. Let's say a prayer that these look good they're just thicker in material and um it's just more it's just better <laughs> Ooh. okay now that they're on i can show you the trick to actually putting on your seamless leggings i know i showed this before in my videos but if you have nails, you got to be super careful, especially if you have a scrunch legging. You never want to go directly and pull up at the scrunch. Start with the fabric on the leg area and kind of grab it with your skin and gradually pull it up so that the material is up here. And I always grab it like around not at the scrunch see that's not flattering because it's not sitting in between the cheeks you see how much lower of a cut this band is it's just top tier so i need more fabric so to do that just pull more fabric from the bottom and work your way up and these fit so good this is a small this is when their sizing was more consistent so i'll never get rid of my og amplify then i'll grab some fabric here pull it around wiggle i feel like it's gonna be a legging day today that's my little tutorial on how to put on scrunch leggings whether they're alphaly amplify or honor active effortless that's how i put them on any type of seamless legging so i'm definitely gonna wear this fit today put these on as well this makes me want to wear my fireside maybe i'll have a week of OG Alphaly Amplify fits because I have some bangers up in my collection. I think we're gonna do that this week. Full week of matching sets because I've been looking like a potato in these like baggy sweatshirts because it's just cold. But I actually wanna feel like a snack, you know what I'm saying? Show off the body yada yada. I just wanna rock, you know? <laughs> I gotta get myself hyped for the gym. I cannot wait to get OxyStride in my body. But yeah, I'm gonna film the rest of my reels and then check back in with you guys with the full fit. And hopefully we'll be at the gym because y'all, they close so early at seven o'clock on the weekends. 
I just want to rock. Bye, yada, yeah. All right, the lighting in my room is atrocious. That looks like I shot this on a freaking iPod Touch. What the hell? Um, all right, I already mixed my pre-workout because like I said, I was doing a video for IG. You don't have to mute that. You're a sweet lady. I just want to show you guys what I did. I've been stuck on this combo recently. Creatine from EHP Labs, duh and the Oxy Shred Peach Rings. I'm definitely gonna need to order another one because it says limited edition and your girl's addicted. So K10 will save you guys at checkout. We're gonna sip on this. I'm gonna edit my little reels and then we're gonna get in a solid like that. Bye. Like right. Oh shoot. I meant to leave my tripod. I don't need that for the gym. I don't think I'm gonna film in the gym today. Bye. Bye. Why are you all up on my stuff? The heck? The heck? What's crazy is the weather here in DC. I don't know. We've experienced, I feel like, four seasons within two days. Yesterday, I swore it felt like winter because it was like 11 degrees when I woke up to take the pups out and then. Today, it feels like 60. I'm like, Mother Nature, are you okay? Because I am confused. I haven't had my pre-workout yet because I really want to get my reels edited. It's like a get ready with me for the gym. I think those are so cute and so motivating. Um, so hopefully I got some good clips, girl. Half of them were freaking fuzzy and I used the back camera so I don't understand. If any of you guys have any tips on how to make the camera quality better, let me know. I have a iPhone 13, so yeah. I brought a sweater, but I don't think I need it. I'm just excited to go to the gym. My little braids are like, I don't know if you can tell, they're like loosening up. Why do they look like that? Why do they look like that though? I guess because I didn't put an elastic on it maybe? I don't know. My mom said it was cute. <laughs> oh my God, I just followed this girl on Instagram, a fitness girl. Let me show you. I don't know who she is. I just liked her vibe. She looked like me. She's so cute. Let me show you her. vibes she has the same length thighs that i do i like to see people with similar body body heights you know what i'm saying leg proportion so i can see you know my own motivation that i too can have gains that look ladies you know what i mean we have those long thighs so i just followed her her name is drea j wellness on instagram and we love it So, I'm gonna go to the gym. Well, do I wanna edit this? Cause then I gotta find a song. It takes me forever. Let me just get into it. Ah, cool. I don't want that ice. I'm just praying it's not gonna be busy. You never know. Sunday is a gamble. You guys, Drea followed me on IG. It's the support for me. Okay, I just edited my reels. Took me forever. I guess it's okay. Um, and the gym looks pretty dead. So, I'm gonna go try and get in some hip thrust. Maybe I'll try a different setup today. <laughs> Last time I attempted to do it, but the bench I wanted to use was occupied. So I just did the same setup that I did the first time. But I'm going for a really good glute pump today. So I'm excited. I'm feeling super cute though. So this is your sign to spend an extra 15 minutes to get yourselves together for the gym. 
but I love it. I found a couple of new fit girls today actually. Only because Honor had posted some fitness girls. Oh my god, I'm like, where's my gym pass? Um, and I was like going through their posts. And I was like, oh my gosh, new people to follow, new motivation. Yeah. Anyway, back to Lil Uzi. I love him for the gym. It's great vibes. Y'all, they took the whole entire Smith machine out. It's pretty pump.
when I tell you that sour strip just about saved my life. <laughs> Sometimes you just need a little sugar. Oh girl. But you guys, I vlogged. First of all, the gym was dead. So I also um slammed my thumb in between two plates. It was throbbing and it's bruising, so <laughs> love that for me. But what I love even more is since I got over my initial gym anxiety the first day, uh, then I would say the second workout was still a little like, ah, but at least I knew what I was expecting. This was my third day working out with a bar, and I got my um, bench, so chef's kiss. I don't know if you guys saw, but they removed the entire Smith machine, so I guess that's great because means they're gonna fix it they took most of the 45 plates so I think I did 245 pounds I did a 45 35 and 25 on each side so that was really good I definitely wanted to work my way up Ow, my thumb hurts so bad pray for my thumb so I love this for me I feel like I'm unlocking a new era of Kayla this year and doing things that I didn't do last year so once I master the hip thrust oh baby it's over we're moving on to deadlifting that's what I want to do next I've never deadlifted before in my life I attempted to but it, it wasn't hitting like I wasn't feeling it so I need to like get the form down and all that stuff so I'm just taking it baby steps at a time and I wanted to show you guys a little bit of a gym vlog I mostly focus on hip thrust that was my heavy lift today and then I did um, some step ups and then I just finished off with some hamstring curls and I was dead so I'm like we're leaving the gym I need to go to the grocery store and figure out dinner I burned 634 calories so we need to eat real good today my breakfast was about 40 grams of protein I had a bagel and some chicken sausage with some pumpkin seed butter so that was a great meal and I filmed a gym reels. So I've had a really bomb Sunday you guys I just know my setup today was chef's kiss because I put the bench That's what I wanted to tell you up against the wall Which is what I wanted to do this entire time because with my body weight pushing against it It's not going anywhere, but I was only able to do that because they took out the smith machine So I'm thinking when they bring it back I'm like, ooh, where can I do my setup because there's literally no wall space everything is so close like I guess by the cables but you know the cables extend so you need space around that area for those people working it so I guess if it's a day where it's dead I could still do it in that general area honestly I'm about to make a little complaint not a complaint but like they have a notes mailbox for suggestions I'm gonna suggest they remove all that strength training equipment off the mirror because then you could use the bar and the people wanting to use the bar can do it in that section so since they're rearranging you know what I'm saying is that gonna make me um annoying if I do that I mean I've been going here for like what two years they see me all the time they're like hey excuse me can y'all rethink this situation <laughs> maybe take out an elliptical or two nobody uses those it's just taking up space but it was so nice to have more floor space and just have like room not to have the bar bang it up against stuff but i mean it is what it is my gym is free i can't really keep complaining but it was definitely a great workout and most importantly i'm happy that i got to take you girls along with me today I want us all to kind of break through these barriers and break through our gym anxiety slash gym fears of trying new things and I promise you like once you get over doing something new one time you're gonna be so like used to doing it it's gonna become a part of your routine because you know what to expect give it like one to three times of doing that new thing and you'll get so used to it like I feel so good now that I've tested out different equipment to feel what feels best for me like height wise with the bench what weights i'm comfortable with and doing 245 like felt really good because the bench i was using before it was just way too high and it was just it, it made it more hard made it harder than it needed to be essentially so i'm feeling really good you guys and i wasn't even planning on doing a gym vlog today that's why i left my tripod at home so sorry for the bad angles but 
uh, moments like this it makes me really excited to document because that's why I have this channel to share my journey share the struggles share the accomplishments and document like the baby steps and the little things so definitely check me out on Instagram I do a lot of fitness inspo over there I just shared my workout from today actually I edited that in the gym because I was dying after those hip thrusts you guys I did like four sets so it was a lot um and I'm also posting like my meals that I'm eating in real time stuff like that and things that I'm loving and the music playlist <laughs> was lit so I just it was just a great workout so oh shout out to Bailey Stewart she just liked my reels I don't know if I should put my fitness YouTube channel in my Instagram bio because it is my smaller channel tell me how I got reached out to for a sponsor on this channel I said what we have like no views but that's so exciting so I don't know about that I'll see how that goes but I'm like my fitness stuff is very much so Instagram so I'm like it would kind of make sense but if you go to my main YouTube it's linked so I don't know what do you guys think I should do I don't know cuz I, I don't know but I don't want to be just fitness you know what I'm saying like I am everything I love lifestyle I love the beauty I love a little fashion you know what I'm saying but the Instagram is looking very I don't know if it's gonna focus it's looking very cool I've been more consistent y'all see the meals stop playing with me so I'm having a lot of fun you know new year new vibes same me just better energy ow my thumb y'all my thumb is for out oh, it's for real throbbing it's for real throbbing right now like ah! i don't know i don't need to go to chipotle but like girl i want to go <laughs> i'm about to well i'm heating up the oven i do not get food out because i'm trying to be good and my thumb update is getting worse, so I don't know what to do about that. But I ended up picking up some ginger and turmeric shots. I only had two, so I think I'll have one right now. Cheers, health as well. Oh, these are good. What's in this? Oh, it's pineapple juice, that's why it's good. I'm gonna keep buying these pineapple juice, ginger, turmeric, lemon, and black pepper. I've got some hummus. I'm just gonna give you guys a quick little haul. You guys will see some meals that I'm planning on making in my next video. Some seedless mini cucumber. I've been really liking the broccolini. So I decided to go ahead and do that again this week. I'm gonna have some tonight. And then I picked up some green bell pepper this week are super good maybe i'll do like a stuffed bell pepper mm. i might do that tomorrow because i have this chicken breast that i'm going to make so that might be good and then in here i just stuffed everything in one bag i got some pitted greek olives a vegan half loaf of sourdough bread some Dough. definitely craving that i love this parmesan guys this is the best vegan cheese i've ever found i've tried literally so many brands i've wasted so much money on really nasty ones this just has that tangy sharp cheesy taste and it's so good i think i'm gonna put this on my stuffed bell peppers this week but i've been eating it in pasta and it's really good unmelted in like caesar salad so highly recommend it's the follow your heart brand and if it does melt it melts really well so love that got some kielbasa sausage for like breakfast some pita chips the multi-grain i also picked up a poppy in the what is this raspberry rose poppy for probiotics I'm trying a different oat milk because this is all they had at Wegmans and it's the plant 
oat, oat milk, I think that's the brand, unsweetened original for my blessed protein smoothies. I'm gonna have a box of these for dinner tonight because it's 30 grams of protein. Oh, marinara sauce. Some penne pasta. We're gonna do like, well, I'm gonna try with this cheese to make like a baked penne pasta. Something like that. So that's why I got this marinara. So that's like my mini grocery run slash meal ideas. Super basic. I don't really do too much. Some um, for me to go. With. Pretty good to me, honestly. I still need to eat like another meal after this, and it's seven o'clock, so we shall see. But the broccolini looks so good, so good. I love ketchup. <laughs> Don't play with it, don't play with it. I said, baby, don't play with it. Here's my dinner, super simple. Took me 20 minutes to prepare and I just can't wait to eat. I think that's gonna wrap up today's fit vlog. Thank you girls for hanging out with me today. I'll probably be back tomorrow because we're, we're in this. We were trying to be consistent and honestly having this channel has really helped me keep accountable. It's helped me try new things and again get out of my comfort zone as well because i'm not playing guys summer's on the corner and i just want to have my dream body i'm tired I'm tired of just like wishing and hoping and maybe we need to put in the work so subscribe if you guys like the daily fitspo from your virtual fitness bestie and i will catch you guys in my next one very soon bye